Good morning. I'm back and I'm better. So today is a very exciting day for me because today is the start of my last day in Oakland. Oh, bittersweet, bittersweet, kind of. Not really. I'm actually really excited. So um, if you watched my last vlog, you saw that I am currently based in Oakland and I live here in Dallas and so I have to fly um, between here and there for work all the time. And that can be really tiring. It's a lot of work. Um, it's just, it's not even a lot of work. Like, that's a weird way to put it. Because, I, I mean, it's just tiring to sit on a plane for three and a half hours just to go to work, to work on a plane for another, you know, six to ten hours. Um, but honestly, you know, I really actually enjoyed my time in Oakland. Um, the people there have been nothing but nice to me. Um... And it's actually a great base. If I could live on the West Coast, I mean, I would. If I could live in the Bay Area, absolutely I would. But uh, the way my bank account's set up, <laughs> it's just, uh, it's really expensive over there. So, um, so I'm out of Oakland as of this trip. So this is a two-day trip. So in two days, I will not be flying to Oakland for work anymore. Um, I'm actually based in Houston next month, so that's going to be a lot closer. It's, there's a lot more flights out of Dallas, from Dallas to Houston, and it's just going to make my life a whole lot easier. Um, but yeah, so, and also I'll be on reserve then, so um, it'll be way easier to be on reserve in Houston um, than it would be to be in Oakland. So yeah, so... Um, it's what time is it now? I never know what time it is on these things. And the clock behind me is broken because our power went out sometime like a few days ago and it reset like the stove time. And so, um, so I haven't changed it because I'm lazy. Um, but I think it's, it's like almost eight. And so I need to leave pretty soon to catch my flight to Oakland to go to work. Today, I only work two legs. It's one from Oakland to Chicago, and then Chicago to Columbus, where I'm overnighting. So, um, yeah, I'm about to head to the airport, and yeah, so if I remember to vlog, not like the last one, then I'll see y'all at the airport, if not. So nothing can ever be simple. I was supposed to just have an easy morning, get on this flight to Oakland. I was going to sleep on my way to Oakland and then go to work, but it didn't work out that way. So since I was going from Dallas to Oakland, that flight ended up being full. And if you're commuting, you still have to fly standby. It's not like a confirmed seat that you get. So I, uh, yeah, the flight was completely full. I wasn't able to get on. So I had to call scheduling and let them know. Thank goodness the, the airline that I work for has a really, really great commuter policy. So it's not like I'm in trouble or anything. It's just kind of a hassle because now they have to, sorry, I dropped something. Now they have to figure out what to do with me. So um, right now I just listed on a flight to St. Louis um, and I got the jumpsuit on that. So I'll definitely be on that flight. And then from there I go and I fly to Chicago and um, I'll pick up on my trip because today I was supposed to go from Oakland to Chicago, Chicago to Columbus, but now I won't be on that Oakland to Chicago flight, so they'll have to replace me with somebody. I don't know what they're gonna do. Um, but yeah, so now I'll be going, Just I'll just be working the uh, Chicago to Columbus flight, so yeah. So not the way I exactly wanted to start my day, and it's kind of funny because I was like, oh, it's my last trip to Oakland. I didn't even go to Oakland. So, nope, just still sitting here at the airport. I'll let y'all know how it goes. So I finally made it to Chicago. Um, why do I never know what time it is anywhere? Wait, I can look at my own watch. That's why I have one. Okay, so it's like 3.30 right now. I don't report until 7. That means my flight doesn't even leave till 8. So I'm just really chilling here. 
and I was down in the lounge earlier and then I was hungry so I came up here to get some food and I didn't want to vlog in the lounge because I felt like everyone was just going to look at me talking to myself and think I was like really weird but not that that's not what people are doing here no actually no one's paying attention to me but yeah so I went and got some food I got a panini so we'll see how good that is but yeah so I'm just literally sitting here for like five hours waiting and I'm not getting paid for this so but I just keep reminding myself that I love my job it's a great job no it's it's fine it's fine it's fine it's fine anyway so I'm gonna eat this and um, yeah one eternity later so about five hours later and I'm finally about to head to my gate I just put on some makeup and tried to fix my hair. Tell me if y'all like my hair better in the bun or in the ponytail. I wear it down sometimes, but I feel like it just gets like in my way when I'm working. So I'm trying to find something that works for all the time. Anyway, so long day. Didn't get paid for anything. But... Yay guys, I finally made it. Look at that highlight though today. Still shining through. Yeah, I'm here in Columbus, Ohio. And um, I just worked that one leg. I just sat in Chicago all day and then I worked that one leg here. And now I'm in my hotel room. And yeah, so they give me a pretty nice room. I'll show it to y'all in just a second. But um, yeah, no, I literally just walked in my room. Now I'm like pacing around like a weirdo. I need to, I don't know, I like to check and make sure, you know, nobody in my closet or anything. Um, yeah, so I'll go ahead and show y'all the hotel. I got the nice two beds. I got two beds. Nice little desk area. I don't even know what the view looks like. I haven't even tried to look. Ooh, it's chilly right here though. Let's see. Okay. Okay, Columbus, I see you. I see you, Columbus. Yeah, I'm actually about to head downstairs with my crew because they are going downstairs to have a drink and maybe get something to eat. And I'm actually kind of excited because for some reason, I'm just, I didn't want to feel like switching the camera so I'm just talking to the mirror. For some reason, I haven't had a lot of crews that wanted to go down and like, or go out or anything, I don't know. I've been delayed a lot and had other issues, but so I'm excited to go down with my crew. Um, I'm about to do that right now. Hey guys, good morning. So, I'm not even going to tell y'all what time it is because I slept in an embarrassing amount of time. But just know I slept good, so I didn't go to bed till like 1.30 or 2. Um, I stayed up chit-chatting with my crew and then there was a bunch of other crews here at the hotel last night too and they all went downstairs and so I had a few beers and hung out with them and it was really fun um so but yeah no I uh, slept way too late um I still got plenty of time though I'm gonna go out and explore Columbus Ohio uh never been here before they said there's like a market that's supposed to be really cool down there so I'm gonna go check that out I need to go find a post office because I have to mail something so that's step one and then I'm gonna go and check out this market hopefully and then I gotta come back and put my uniform on and uh, get ready for this five-hour flight that I have today so I have like a five-hour flight and then like two one-hour flights so the one-hour ones will be really easy I don't, I don't even think there's a lot of passengers on those flights but this one's like full and it's five hours so yeah it's gonna be a long five hours of my life but it'll be all right and then I'll be back in Oakland and then I think I will sleep in Oakland tonight and then I will head back to Dallas tomorrow and um, I'll actually have a few days in Dallas which I haven't had in a while I haven't had a few days at home in a while so I'm really excited um, I actually have to fly into Houston first though because um, I don't know if I mentioned this or not I might be repeating myself but this is my last trip out of Oakland and next month I'm based in Houston. 
So I had to get a crash pad in Houston, basically just a house full of flight attendants to stay in, um, the commuting flight attendants. And so, yeah, I need to go, I found one and I need to go check it out and go put my deposit down on that so that I'll have somewhere to stay and I will no longer have to sleep on the floor. Praise the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. But yeah, so I'm gonna go check all this stuff out and I'll show y'all what I find. So I'm here at this North Market. We're about to go see what this place is about. I really have no idea what this is gonna be, but I'm hungry, so I'm hoping they have food. I feel like my vlogs are basically just me trying to find food all over the country. But yeah, so let's go. Basically, this place is all stuff to eat, so it's like a little farmer's market, which makes sense because it's called the North Market, but yeah, so I like it a lot. People are looking at me so strange, like why is she talking to her phone? But yeah, no, so it ended up being really, really a cool little adventure outside of the hotel. So yeah, I'm about to eat this food and probably head back to the hotel because I gotta go get ready because I actually do have to work today. Okay, y'all, I am ready to go. It was fun, Columbus. I'm gonna miss it. I actually, it, this is a beautiful city, honestly. This has actually been a really great overnight. I really, really like Columbus. So, um, but yeah, no, I am about to go downstairs and meet my crew in the lobby and get ready for this long flight. We're about to take this five hour flight to Oakland. And yeah, so, but, the, like I've said over and over and over again, this is my last Oakland trip, so I'm excited. A little sad, mostly excited. And then I get to go home for a few days. So, if I could just get through today, oh, and then, yeah, so I'm going to try to sleep in the lounge again. And I'm so sad that I might get the floor, because we're not getting in until I think like 10 o'clock. So, we'll see. I really don't want to. So, y'all pray for me, even though if you're seeing this, it's going to be like way after. But yeah, pray that I get a chair at least. So, if not a couch, but pray I get a couch. I'm not gonna get a couch. Anyway, but yeah, so this is my last lounge night. I'm so excited, thank goodness. But yeah, I'm gonna finish packing up all the rest of my stuff and head downstairs. I think it's so funny the difference that it makes like right before I leave for a flight and then right when I get back of like how I look. Like right now I just look like I've been through a lot, which actually I have. I don't want to get into all of it, but it was an interesting day for sure. Uh, we just had some issues with passengers, and but I don't really want to talk about it. But yeah, now so now I'm hiking to the lounge as usual. It's like 10:30 at night. Hey, I actually knew what time it was, and we're gonna see if there's anywhere for me to sleep. I just want at least like one chair. I don't want to sleep on the floor again. I'm honestly like really tired. And if I have to sleep on the floor, I'm gonna be so grumpy. But it'll be fine. It's actually my last night 
of sleeping in the lounge ever, hopefully, in my life again. So, I will make the best of it, but let's just look and see how this goes. So, Oakland was good to me on my last night. I had somewhere to sleep, which was fantastic. And I feel very well rested and I'm going home. And honestly a little sad to say goodbye to Oakland. It's my first base ever, guys. But yeah, no, good trip. Everything is good and now I'm going home. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And um, yeah, I don't really know how to end these. So hopefully that gets better with time. But yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.